morning, Pastor Steve here. Matthew 6, 16 through 18. Moreover, when you fast, be not as the hypocrites of a sad countenance, for they disfigure their faces, that they may appear unto men to fast. Verily I say to you, they have their reward. But you, when you fast, anoint your head, wash your face, that when you appear not to men to fast, but unto your Father, which is in secret, and your Father which sees in secret will reward you openly. I recall several years ago a major player in the church world announced that he was fasting for X number of days for some spiritual purpose or another. I remember chuckling and recalling these very verses. You see, I'm much more subtle than that. I would never write out, come and say, I'm fasting, but I can almost guarantee in some manner people would know about my spiritual discipline done only for God, or would it be? My point is, if you're doing something for God, just do it for God. If you're trying to make a religious statement about your own piety or my own piety, go play golf instead. Now that would be a sacrifice for me as I stink at it. I gave it up for Lent, as a matter of fact. <laughs> no, not really. But if I did, and I posted that, the spiritual value before God would be diminished. So, when someone lets you know, not to brag of course, about their spiritual disciplines, and you are practicing one as well, just smile and say, how nice, may God bless your efforts. In the meantime, in the meantime, God will be checking you out at his heavenly rewards desk. You ponder that, Pastor Steve.